Hi guys, so today I am going to be doing a thrift haul. Um, a couple of weeks ago I went to New Jersey for uh, two different concerts, uh, the Stray Cats, who are absolutely legendary, um, with Brian Setzer, Lee Rocker, Slim Jim Phantom, just amazing. They are amazing live. Um, I've waited a long time for them to get back together and they finally did and I finally got to see them. And uh, Gavin DeGraw, who is my one and only most favorite artist ever. I actually got to meet him. Um, he was walking on the street. Me and my boyfriend were getting out of dinner in town and we were just walking the street and so was he. And we ended up crossing paths and it was the most amazing thing ever. Um, I got to meet my fav favorite artist ever. I'm even flustered just thinking about it and talking about it. Um, but anyway, I am going to do a thrift haul. Um, it's mainly a fall thrift haul. Um, we went thrifting in New Jersey when we were there. Um, and now, you know, things are starting to bring fall things outside. Um, it is August. The last two days have been in the 70s. So it's felt like a fall day for the past couple of days. So I was like, why not break out the flannels and, you know, put on a wig and have some fun with some makeup and uh, make a video, why not? Um, I wanna start off with things that I got uh, two days ago. Uh, I got these things home. Me and my boyfriend went to see uh, the Scary Stories, Shell in the Dark movie. Um, that was awesome because I own the books. I have loved the books as kids. I, uh, I have lots of memories with those books, and I didn't, I didn't really know what to expect with that movie. Um, honestly, I, I didn't really expect anything because I knew they were kids' books. I wasn't sure if they were just gonna go chronologically and do the stories throughout the books, but they made their own plot. They incorporated, uh, incorporated the stories in them, and, uh, I thought it was awesome. Uh, it was a really good movie. I definitely think I'm gonna buy it when it comes out. Uh, so afterwards, we went to dinner, and we went, and we did a little bit of shopping. We were trying to find, um, stores with Halloween things in them. We went to Home Goods, Michael's, um, what else did we go to? Walmart. I feel like I'm missing one, but we went to a couple different stores. Um, I had to go to Bath and Body Works to see if they had my perfume, which they did. Um, I got this Sweet Cinnamon Pumpkin. I have the larger bottle of this, but when I want to bring the perfume in my purse. I don't always want to carry a big bottle, so this is definitely my fall scent, the sweet cinnamon pumpkin. And then I just got another small, um, you know, the apple scent, because I feel like uh, I start out fall with the apple smell and then do the uh, sweet cinnamon pumpkin in the, the lotion as well. Um, I also found this at Michael's. I love Hocus Pocus. Anybody knows me that knows that I love Hocus Pocus. Um, I found this. It was six dollars. Um, it was more than I wanted to pay for something small like this, but I'm excited to get started on getting decorations and things like that. Um, I noticed Michaels and Home Goods had um, very vintagey. Like this is a vintagey Halloween type of vibe. Um, all of their stuff was more vintage Halloween type of thing, um, which isn't all bad, but it's definitely not my favorite, but I also don't like the bright, vibrant, like, little kid Halloween type things anymore since I'm an adult. Um, so me and my boyfriend are planning to move within the next year, so we're hoping to start collecting decorations for both Halloween and Christmas, uh, for, you know, our potential house in the future. But anyway, let's get started on my thrift haul. Um, some of these things I bought and some of them my boyfriend bought for me. Uh, we went to a couple different Goodwills and a couple different, um, I think we went to Salvation Army also. Um, I do have a purse that I'm using right now that isn't in this room, so I can't show you that. Um, actually, I got two purses. I lied. I got two purses that are not in this room to show you. I'm sorry. Um... <laughs> Anyway, we're going to start with, I guess, this. This is a giant, you know, I call them grandma sweaters. It's like a giant cardigan sweater for the winter. Um, I usually call them grandma sweaters because I absolutely love 
oversized big knit sweaters that are just soft to the touch for fall and winter uh so i got this it's purple it's very very soft and i'm so excited to wear it um what else is next oh i got um this shirt it's just you know a cute little tank top top it's got um white lace usually i love black lace but white lace works too uh well actually it's kind of like a creamy lace creamy lace on top i could wear this probably with jeans or uh leggings yoga pants whatever some boots in the fall um maybe a jacket over it or i could even just wear it in the summer with a pair of shorts or jeans or something like that so i figured that would be cool um This is just a plain v-neck shirt. It's in like a cranberry color. Um, I like to get v-necks, especially when they're anywhere from a dollar to three dollars at Goodwill or Salvation Army. They're good to collect, uh, to layer with, to put, you know, under jackets in the fall, different things like that. Um, I always find them useful. So um, I picked up another v-neck. Okay, so every time I go thrifting, I always look in the women's, men's, and even kids' sections. Um, when you go thrifting, my trick is, since I'm very short and very petite and small, um, I do find a lot of different things in each section of um, either Goodwill or Salvation Army or wherever I go, tend to thrift. Um, because it's not like a department store, it doesn't have set, like, yeah, you might go into the kids' aisle and it'll have kid things in it. But it also will have maybe Charlotte Russe crop tops that maybe whoever put things on racks didn't know, whatever. I always find things in the kids section that are for teens or adults. Um, but I also look for hoodies every time I go. I have an, um, just a massive abundance of hoodies that I actually am going to be going through today because I'm doing a... Um, a clean out of my room and organization and just I'm trying to do a bunch of stuff so right now like I'm actually washing my comforter so it's not on my bed right now but um anyway I got this it's a Las Vegas Nevada hoodie it's just really comfortable and uh it's funny because I was thrifting with my boyfriend and we ended up going to Las Vegas in May I ended up just going and going with him and it wasn't even planned he had planned it a while before and kept asking me to go and I didn't think I could go because of work and other different things and finally I was just like you know what literally the day before we got a plane ticket and I just I went and it was the best vacation best experience of my life and I'm glad I, I went so uh when we saw this I was super excited I was like I have to have this it was only a couple dollars so why not right um, what is next? Oh, this dress is really cute. It can be worn in the summer or fall. Um, it's just black and white striped. The back has uh, bows on it. I figured I can wear this either summer or fall. Just summer by itself with some sandals. Or fall, you can uh, either wear it by itself with boots or put leggings under it with boots and a cute jacket. I thought that would be really cool. Um... Ah uh, yes, another flannel. Uh, if you know me, you know that I love flannels, especially in the fall. I think the flannel and tall boots look is really cute. Um, so I just grabbed another flannel. I wasn't going to get it because I was like, I have too many. But when I tried it on, I was just like, you know what? Why not? Like, it's very comfortable. It's just, it's purple plaid. I think I only have one other purple plaid shirt um the one i'm wearing is more of a maroon color but um all right what else oh we went to five below and i just i got a perfume also uh this smells really good it's supposed to be a knockoff of the britney spears brand the you know the small like round bottle with the jewels on it it's supposed to be like a knockoff brand of that um i do have a britney spears perfume i think i have curious and it kind of um it like messes with my nose. It, it, I think I'm allergic to it actually. So I figured I'd try the knockoff brand see what happens. Um, let's see what else. Oh, I found this. Somebody had custom made this because you can tell it was a t-shirt. You can tell this was um, 
sewn on the inside from a t-shirt, but somebody had turned a Nine Inch Nails t-shirt into a tube top, and I thought that was cool. Um, so there it says Nine Inch Nails on the back with the album on it. I actually haven't listened to Nine Inch Nails in a long time. Um, but when I saw this, I was like, oh my god, I definitely know songs from them. I listened to them, you know, in my younger, like, high school days. And, uh, I figured, why not? It literally was $3. So I was like, for $3, I could use this, make, like, a grunge look or, you know, anything. Like, I thought this was super cool. I always wanted to learn how to make a tube top out of a t-shirt. And you can tell that they had sewed it and done it themselves. Uh, it's not the best job, but definitely better than what I could do. So I was like, why not? For $3, I can make like a grunge look with it or something. There was also different kinds of shoes. in this. There, we went to this really big Goodwill, and this is where I got most of these things, but not all of it. Um, there were different shoes and boots and things like that. And a lot of them looked and felt brand new. So I got these for fall. Um, I love tall boots. I love tall boots with jeans or with leggings and plaid shirts and jean jackets and, you know, green, like, navy kind of jackets. Like, I love tall boots. So, I got these for fall. Um, oh, I saw these and thought these were super cute. Um, these heels, they have bows on them and lace. I absolutely love anything lace. So uh, I wasn't sure where I'd wear them because I have a ton of heels that I've never worn before that I bought and was like, oh, I'm going to wear these somewhere. And it's like, I don't. But I couldn't let these go because they fit perfectly and they were really cheap. They were only like 6 or $7. And the last, oh wait, no, there's one more thing after this. Um, these boots I also thought were perfect for fall too. At first I wasn't sure because I was like, I don't want... Um, I wasn't sure because it's like faded but then I realized that it's a purposely kind of faded so it looks like an old like punkish type of boot I thought these would be cute in the fall for um you know for fall with again jeans leggings plaid shirts jean jackets things like that I absolutely love fall fashion so I thought these would be really cute and my last thing I think is this um it's just a it's kind of wrinkled but like it's just a you know like a green kind of vest jacket thing i thought that'd also be good for like early fall with jeans and some tall boots or something like that um i absolutely love it i also got other things thrifting on a different day with my boyfriend but all that stuff i had already washed and you know, didn't think about making a video until now. So all that stuff is kind of like already put away and washed and everything. But um, I got a fall jacket. I got a couple of um, big bags. One, I don't remember the name of it, but it's tiny and has zippers on it. And the other one, it was a big, giant Steve Maiden bag. And I love Steve Maiden. Uh, he, I love Steve Maiden bags, shoes, everything. Um, so I hope everyone has a good day. I hope you get to enjoy this beautiful weather wherever you are. I'm hoping that, um, you know, not that I want cold weather to come fast, but these days are also nice to have, just to have a little cool down from all the excessive heat of summer. Um, summer and fall are my favorite seasons, so if it could be summer and fall year round, I would be so happy. Uh, so I hope everyone has a great day, and uh, I think I'm going to be doing some Vlogoween videos, so uh, watch out for those. Um, follow, add me, message me, comment in this video, tell me if you liked it, if you liked the clothing that I got, um, if you want to see more thrift hauls, and what else you want to see content-wise from me. Uh, any questions, comment or message, and I hope you have a great day.